Welcome back to Tiny Town. It's been 84 years. <laughs> it hasn't been that long, but it feels like it's been ages since I've been in this world. Last time we were over here, we were building demagogue and dragons and stuff. There was all sorts of craziness happening, and we got this dude down here. Most of you guessed that this guy that I built was actually Kratos from God of War. Oh my god, I just wiped out an entire island. That's what Kratos can do, man. He can just delete islands with his face. Alright, let's get rid of this. I'm gonna be building another video video game character here. I want you guys to guess who this video game character is. This one's gonna kind of be- no, I'm not gonna say anything. I'll give it away. I don't want to give it away. Okay, perfect. I'm going with this guy right here. He looks just like a general worker. That's a little bit of a clue, and that's the only clue you guys are getting. <laughs> All right, let's go like this with this guy. This guy is in I'm about ready to poop pose. That's what he is He's like bracing himself for the mad poops. That's about to happen. Okay, so we're down on video game island We've got this guy now. You have to let me know what video game he's from as well Not just what character he is not that I know who this guy is. I don't know his name. Okay I'm gonna get this toilet roll and I'm gonna put this on his back <laughs> Let's get that on there like that. That is very appropriate. I wonder if you guys are already putting guesses in the comments. All right, yeah, 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 that looks good. Okay, this is also good. Let's put that there like that. Oh my god, this is brilliant. It's a masterpiece. A lot of you guys have been asking me to play Tiny Town for quite a while, and I've just been playing a whole bunch of other games. There's just been so much to play, but guess what? We're playing Tiny Town right now, in case you hadn't noticed. All right, let's get this. Okay, this is gonna be... Well, it's blue, of course. All right, this bit right here is the strongest clue that you guys are getting in this particular character. If you can't guess it from this, you're not gonna guess it. If you can guess it, well, then you're the smartest person in the world. All right, let's go like that. These are supposed to be... No, I can't say. I can't say. I'll give it away. All right, almost done. And that right there is our character. Check him out. Who does he look like? I don't know. Have your guesses in the comments. <laughs> Alright, let's go over this way. So in this video, we're obviously making Choo Choo Charles. It's been one of the most requested things for me to make in Teardown. Teardown? Tiny Town ever. So we're gonna be making it. First though, we're gonna be making something else. I need to find a really good spot to build a car. I know. Let's do it over here, over near this lady's place. Oh my god, what was her name? I don't know. The lady who has the demogorgon duck just in her yard. Alright, this car has come to life. Yeah, that's right. This is the car. Okay, now we need to get some spider legs. Now this is obviously a Choo Choo Charles inspired car. It doesn't have a name. I want you guys to name it. Alright, we've got to put some spider legs on it like that. There we go. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Alright. I made these spider legs myself. I made them in Google Blocks. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, this is not an evil monster, this one. This one's actually a happy one. So come up with a friendly name. Not a, you know, not like Murderous Mike or something like that. I don't want it to be that. <laughs> I want it to be a nice name. All right, yeah, cool. All right, it's kind of climbing on the roof here a little bit of the house. It has no respect for boundaries, even though it's a nice one. All right, how's that? Oh my god, that is beautiful. We need to give it a face. And guys, if there's anything that you want me to build in Tiny Town, just let me know in the comments. We'll go ahead and we'll build it. All right, let's give it some blue eyes. There we go. Just some eyes like this. Yes. Yes. It looks like Noddy, except Spider Noddy. <laughs> okay, I need to make some lips. What about eggplant lips? Is that a thing? Can you make eggplant lips? Okay, no. It looks like he just went over town with like the lip fillers and they've gone purple and gross. They've turned it into vegetables. Ah, oh, that's beautiful. Look at that face. That is a car you would want to kiss. Look at them lips. I'm just kidding. Those are chili lips that will burn your mouth. Oh, I should have just gone like this. You know what I mean? Like just a, just a poopy Tim head right there like that. That looks so good. Oh my God, that even works. Look at that. Look at that. That's, that's, should I leave the poopy Tim head? Or should I leave whatever the heck that is right there? I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments which one you think is better. That's pretty amazing. I'm not gonna lie. That's great. <laughs> Alright, let's just put it there on the side. We'll turn it into the house. The house now has a face. Okay, let's get this lady here. This is her car. And it's turned into a spider car. And she's trying to get in it. But she can't get in it because it's just way too tall off the ground now. And she's like, holy crap. Whatever your name is. Can you like lower it down a little bit so I can at least climb in the passenger seat so you can drive? <laughs> no, she's struggling big time. Let's just put them on there. There we go. Oh yeah. 
they fit so well. Okay, so that there is looking perfect. I'm gonna head over this way to where we've got our new train track set up. I built this thing off cam, it's looking pretty good. The train track goes through this way, goes through the forest, and then it ends up here at the train station. Over the other end though, I, I don't know what to do here. I thought maybe like a train crash or something like that. I don't know, what do you guys reckon? Okay, but I'm gonna be building up my scene here. This is where we're gonna be putting Charles. This is gonna be so good. I've even got a face for Charles, just because I figured that I wouldn't be able to make that in Tiny Town. All right, there it is. There's Charles's face. I'm just gonna put that on the ground there. Let's not lose that. Actually, let's put it in the tree. I also had a bit of an idea to maybe build Gus the bus. I don't know if you guys have played Choo Choo Charles, but there's reference to something called Gus the bus that uh, Choo Choo Charles is actually scared of. I'm gonna start off with this. This is gonna be just, I don't know, a placeholder. I don't know. Do you guys want me to build him? Maybe I can. Maybe we'll give him spider legs. Maybe he's a centipede thing. I have no idea. Okay, we've got to get the size of this thing right. So I've got this guy right here. He can be me. He's the human for scale. And then I've also got a banana here. That's the banana for scale. There we go. You guys can stand right there. We need to start building this Charles. This is going to be so intense. Also, I'm going to give this guy an axe just in case he feels scared. Or if he wants to chop the banana up and eat it. Okay, let's start getting some spider legs just so I can work out roughly how big this size is. Oh my god. This is going to be a really good Charles. I'm going to make his legs about that big. I reckon that's about perfect, maybe. And I've got to start working out what I'm even going to build this Charles out of. I have no... Oh my god, that is like almost the perfect piece. Except it's a little bit not the perfect piece. Get out of here. <laughs> All right, what else do we have? Oh, we got this thing. That's some more luggage. It's the wrong red. Okay, I think this is what I'm after. So I'm going to get this piece here like that. That looks really good. And then we'll go just like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that move. That worked out really well. All right, then I'll put that there like that. Okay, let's have a look at like a red square. How does this look? Oh, they're definitely different kinds of red. That looks terrible. Okay, maybe if I just go like, nah, that's just not gonna work. Okay, okay, that's not looking too bad. I'm gonna go ahead and just delete those though. There we go. Let's just pretend they never existed. Okay, then we go like that and, oh, oh my God, this is working. This is working. Yes, I'm a genius. <laughs> <laughs> then we'll put that on there like that. Oh man, that is almost perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, then we need another cylinder. He's got multiple cylinders for some reason. I have no idea why. I'm not a train mechanic. Don't even ask me. All right. Yeah, cool. Let's get the face on there. All right. I think that's a really good start. Let's go ahead and position some of these legs so we can get a bit of an idea about if they're too big or too small. No, I think they're just right. <laughs> awesome. I'm kind of looking to forward to building Gus the Bus now. Look at this guy. This is a piece of crap. Let's just throw that in the lake. <laughs> I'm not going to really use this for Gus the Bus. I'm thinking like maybe if I can get another yellow school bus somewhere. And I don't know. We'll give it feet or something. Who knows? Maybe crab arms. All right. Get some more legs on there as well. Oh, cool. So I haven't done any VR in a while because I actually moved offices and I didn't have any VR set up. Well, it's set up now. And guess what? There's hardly any VR games to play. But hopefully that changes soon. I'm looking forward to Undead Development 2 whenever that comes out. Okay, not looking too bad. Oh, those are going to be perfect wheels. All right, I'll get these as well. We'll chuck them down here. There we go. Just bung a few wheels on the side there. That way it looks like he can roll around if he wants to, but he never uses his wheels. He's just all about the spider legs. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not looking bad. Okay, now we need a bit of a chimney thing on top of his noggin. Uh, pro probably just this. <laughs> that goes there, I think. Yeah, I think he's got these down here like this. I've got no idea what they're for. Crushing people, stabbing people, no idea. Oh, I think this could be perfect. Is that a square? Oh my god, I finished him off. I've given him a hat. Yeah. Yeah, I'm super happy about that. Okay, now we need to actually do his face, because at the moment he's just a mouth, and that's not very scary at all. It's even less scary if you put like a giant banana in his mouth. Look at that. He's eating a banana. <laughs> all right, let's put that down there. Oh my god. I've ruined my banana to scale, and now I don't know what's actually the right scale. Okay, the first thing we have to do is give this guy some eyes. I'm just going to use these ones. I think those are pretty good. <laughs> yeah, they look good. Actually, a bit smaller. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like it. All right. Now we need some lips or teeth. We'll give them teeth first. All right. I'm going to use these. 
these are the best teeth. And we need lots of teeth. These guys are gonna be so creepy, man. All right, a few more teeth. Put them in on weird angles and stuff. And yeah, get some down the bottom. Don't forget to have a guess at what my video game character was that I built over there on Video Game Island. And he's got a red hand, he's got a blue hand. Why would he have those hands? What's he using them for? All right, oh my God, yeah, that looks great. Okay. Now he needs some lips. I wonder if I could just use the Huggy Wuggy lips. Nah, they're too big. <laughs> they're way too big. He looks too much like Huggy Wuggy. I mean, it's not terrible, but it's it's just not quite. He looks like a ripoff, you know what I mean? Like Huggy Wuggy did his lipstick. All right, maybe I can use these. Maybe these will work. Yeah, they work pretty well. All right, we're getting a bit of an outline happening. My arms are starting to feel like they just want to fall off because this is so hard to do. <laughs> oh, yes. Okay, I'm, I'm getting pretty happy with it. It's looking almost finished. And then we just need some red rings around his eyes because his eyes are always super bloodshot. That or someone just painted his eyeballs for him. Okay, let's get these. And oh, I just moved his lips. I'm just ripping apart his lips. Yeah, that, I'm, I'm really happy with that. Okay, let's have this guy actually running away from him. <laughs> there we go. He's got a good run on. And for some reason, he grabbed the banana and he left the axe behind because he's super dumb. And he's just running with this giant banana in his hand. Just like this mega banana. It's huge. It's like a baton. <laughs> I don't know. I reckon it's awesome. All right, guys. I want you to rate my Choo Choo Charles out of 53. All right. Is it a solid 53? Maybe it's a 35. I don't know. What do you guys reckon? Let me know in the comments. But thank you very much for watching this video. I'll catch you guys next time.